football icon David Beckham handed control of his Instagram account over to a Ukrainian doctor so the world could get a close look at the devastation of the conflict. Dr. Irina, a medic in the city of Kharkiv, was given access on Sunday to shed more light on the Russian invasion. The doctor, head of the regional perinatal center, spent the day posting videos and photo detailing the tireless work the professionals are doing. The superstar, 46, has more than 71 million followers on the social media platform. The footage showed newborn babies being treated and a basement where patients have had to be moved to escape the bombings. The former Manchester United and England A said he wanted to highlight the amazing work Irina and other health workers like her are doing to save lives in Ukraine. Dr. Irina said her work had been 24-7 since the illegal Russian invasion of the country. The first days were the most difficult. We had to learn how to work with bombings and strikes, she said. We are probably risking our lives but we don't think about it at all. We love our work. Doctors and nurses here, we worry, we cry but none of us will give up. Speaking in a video on Instagram, the former midfielder said, Hi everyone, so I'm handing over my social media to Irina, the head of the regional perinatal center in Kharkiv, Ukraine where she is helping pregnant mothers give birth safely. Thanks to your donations, the oxygen generators they have received are helping newborns survive in appalling conditions. took time out to encourage his followers around the world to donate to UNICEF, the UN aid agency for which he serves as an ambassador. David and wife Victoria are reported to have donated £1 million to help fund the organization's work in Ukraine. He handed over his Instagram to the medic to show how deep the crisis is becoming. Writing on Instagram stories, the doctor went on, On the first day of war, all pregnant women and mothers were evacuated to the basement. It was a terrible three hours that we spent together. Unfortunately, we can't take babies who are in intensive care to the basement because they rely on life-saving equipment. Now, I'm not only the head of the center but I continue to work as a pediatric anesthesiologist. I unload cargo, work on logistics and offer emotional support. She added, UNICEF's support is very important to us, they have been delivering supplies in Ukraine for years and they have good logistics to deliver ready-to-use kits to maternity hospitals.